Dog Pod. And I had one show up today. Uh, we're going to unbox this thing. I'm going to show you what you're going to get in the box. I'm going to give you guys my initial thoughts on this. Been looking forward to this one a long time. Let's hop into it. Alright, we got the back off this thing. Let's take a look. Uh, first off, just to start off, this is the Bog Pod CLD3. This is an extremely tough tripod to get right now. Uh, they are not in stock on the Battenfield website. I bought this from bnhphoto.com. So let's hop in and take a look and see what we got in the box. Nice piece of cardboard there. All right, when we open this up, I can see that this comes with the stock yoke. Uh, I've ordered a couple extra yokes for it. This is the switcheroo system. Uh, feels like the head on it, and it is plastic. This is the camo version. So we'll, uh, we'll hop back on this tripod here in just a second. Right, let's see what else we got in the package first. Looks like we got a bog pod instruction manual. Bat and feel. I know there is some uh, there are some things with this tripod, some kind of some do's and don'ts under some screws that you're supposed to tighten, some that you aren't supposed to tighten. So I'm gonna do a little bit of research on that. Looks like we got a little carrying case here. Bog pod symbol on it. Feels like there may be something up in here. Are right, we got an Allen wrench here. Uh, looks like there's two different sizes on this Allen wrench. All right, we got a big size and a small size. Uh, looks like the big size is going to fit the, if that's going to fit the texture on the top. And it looks like the smaller size is going to fit down here. I'm not going to mess with any of these. There's, there's two adjustments down here. One here and one here. And from what I understand, one you want to mess with and one you don't want to mess with. So I'm going to do a little bit more research on that. Uh, bag looks nice. This, this is going to be nice uh, kind of for storage in the car and whatnot. A little pouch here to put whatever you want in there. Looks like it's got a little clip here to toss that over your shoulder. That's going to be kind of nice whenever I'm out hiking or whatever. Toss that over my back. So, all right, let's get on with this. Take a look at the actual bog pod. Um, I'm not gonna do a complete review on this today. I'm just gonna kind of do some of the quick features of this bog pod and we'll get a little bit more detail after I've used this thing and give my uh, full review on it. Uh, so, on the bottom here, put some Velcro on there kind of secure the legs together when not in use. I'll wind that up another day. Legs are gonna go out 45 degree angle. It's nice. Feels uh, the stop on it's very nice. Yeah, there we are. Like I said, I've ordered a couple different yokes for this one. Looking forward to getting those in. Um, they're all with the switcheroo system. I got the wide yoke, which is very tough to get, but Battenfield does stock that again right now. And I also ordered the swivel rifle head mount. We are gonna get this thing out and use it just as soon as we can. I can't wait to use it uh, for nothing but good things. Uh, once again, got this at B&H Photo. Uh, it was not in stock on the Battenfield website whenever I went to buy it. B&H Photo had it in stock. They were about $20 cheaper than the Batfield website. Uh, I was a little bit worried about what I was going to be getting in the mail, but it was all legit, it was all good. So we're going to get this out and uh, see if we can snag a couple riders. We'll see you guys back. Click that uh, subscribe button if you guys are liking these videos and uh, give them a big thumbs up and uh, we'll see you for the next one.